Joe Mertens is 97 years old, but he still recalls well serving our country in World War II. This week's hometown hero tells us about his time in the Navy nearly 80 years ago and what it feels like to be honored in a big way decades later. Because all of my friends did it. For Green Bay native Joe Mertens, that was enough reason for him to join the U.S. Navy in 1943 in the thick of World War II. Well, at the time when I was 17 years old, it didn't really mean too much other than the fact that all of my friends were doing it, so it must be pretty good. So I did. Headed overseas aboard a troop ship with 1,500 others, Mertens found himself in the middle of the Pacific Theater. But he says that was just about his only time aboard a ship. That's what all you think about, what they say. Join the Navy, see the world. All I've seen was so far was the jungles. For 32 months and 15 days, Merton spent time as a gunner's mate between Gamadoto and Gilly Gilly naval bases, seeing some of World War II's greatest battles. Because of that, eight decades later, Merton's was honored by Representative Mike Gallagher with four prestigious medals, including the Asiatic Pacific Combat Medal and the World War II Victory Medal. For us to do this for Joe is incredibly inspiring. Uh, the greatest generation gets that name for a reason, and to see his incredible family, his wife, uh, you know, he had, they had six kids, 28 grandkids. I mean, it's just, just an incredible, incredible story of service and a beautiful Northeast Wisconsin story. And many of those friends and family members looked on in admiration at this U.S. Navy vet, perhaps no one more than Merton's eldest son. That's been an inspiration to all of us, especially myself, a veteran, my brother-in-law, and Joe's grandson was a veteran. Uh, it really gave us a person in my father to look up to as we fulfilled our military service. And for Mertens himself, his service and this recognition are something he'll always remember. This is the greatest thing that could ever happen to anybody. Anybody, I don't care who, what, or where. This is something that you cannot just put aside. I'll never forget it. And we thank you for your service, Joe. And Mertens also received the Honorable Discharge Button and the Honorable Service Lapel Pin, also known as the Ruptured Duck. Don't forget, if you know someone who you would like to nominate for our Hometown Hero Award, just send an email to WFRVHometownHeroes at WeAreGreenBay.com. For Local 5 News, I'm Caitlin Corbett. And a programming reminder for our viewers, join Local 5's Caitlin Corbett tonight as we honor our local men and women veterans in a special broadcast of Hometown Heroes. Hear their stories of valor and sacrifice tonight at 6.30, only here on Local 5. And let's take a look.